Hi, and welcome back to Cord Cutters LI. A few months ago, I did a video on how to remap the buttons on your new Amazon Fire Stick 4K Max, or the other Fire Sticks that have the buttons for the, for the different apps, the Netflix, Disney+, Plus, Hulu, etc. Unfortunately, with the latest updates of the Amazon Fire OS, it broke those buttons, and they no longer work. A couple of people let me know in the comments of that video, and also on Twitter, and I had to look into it. The buttons continued to work for me, because I didn't run the latest updates on my Fire Stick. So when I went to test, everything worked fine. However, I went and updated my Fire OS on my Amazon Fire Stick 4K Max, and guess what, they broke. So in this video, I'm gonna show you a workaround. It's not the easiest, but it's not too bad either. You can do it, there's nothing to it. There is a disclaimer though, there is a chance that Amazon will once again update their system and break this workaround. For now, this works and give it a try and let me know if it works for you. So if you're ready to remap your buttons again, grab your remote and let's go. If you're in the market for a VPN service to help you stay connected and protected while streaming, have a click on one of the links in the description below. Doing so not only gets you a great discount on your next VPN subscription, it also helps to support the Cord Cutters Li channel. Okay, so I'm here with the Fire TV Stick 4K Max. The instructions in this video are going to assume that you do not have any of the remapper buttons installed. If you do, um, they probably don't work, so you will need to start by uninstalling those. You can do that um, you know, in the settings, or you can use a File Explorer app to remove them, whichever, whichever works for you but I'm going to go ahead and start from that point as if you have never had them installed and go through all the steps that we need to do. So the first thing you need to do is go over to the gear, turn on a couple of settings, go down to My Fire TV, go into Developer Options. We'll need to turn on ADB Debugging and also go into Install Unknown Apps and just go to Downloader and make sure that this says on. If it doesn't say on, click it to make it say on, and that's it. Click the Home button. So the next thing you're gonna do, I'm gonna show you just one of the buttons. I'm gonna install the Disney Plus. I'm going to install the Disney Plus remapper. So when you press the Disney Plus button on your Fire Stick remote, it will open up. In my case, I'll probably pick something like Amazon Music or something. So let's go ahead and move over to Downloader. You're going to want to go to the cordcuttersli.com downloads page or just type in the short code 61187. If you hit the little hamburger button, and then hit the hamburger button again. We'll go to full screen so you can see a little easier. The two apps that we're going to need, one of them we're going to install now, and the other one we're not going to install now, and it's very important that you don't. So let's go to the one that we're not going to install first, and that is we'll go down and find the Disney Plus Remapper button. I'll move myself out of the way, and we'll move over and click Download. So it's important not to install this at this point, and I'll explain why in a minute. So just go down and hit cancel. We're not going to install it. Move over to done. So now let's move up and find the other app that we're going to need is remote ADB shell. But this one we're gonna go ahead and install. So click the download button Move down and over to install. And we can click done. We don't have to open it quite yet. And click delete because we no longer need that installation file for remote ADB shell. Now let's hit the home button. So let's find now the remote ADB shell app. Move to the left, which will jump you to the other side. Go to apps. And then down at the bottom of the list, this is the ADB shell program. So open that up.
Just click OK on this, no worries. Now for the IP address, you're going to want to type in 127.0.0.1. Click Next. And for the port on this one, you're going to leave it at 5555 and click Next. Click connect. You're going to want to check this box that says always allow from this computer and then go down and click OK. I'll put the specific lines that you'll need for each of the buttons for Netflix, Hulu or Disney Plus in the description of the video. I'm going to use a Bluetooth keyboard here so it's a lot easier to type in the code. CP space forward slash SD card forward slash downloader forward slash remapper for Disney Plus dot APK space forward slash data forward slash local forward slash TMP forward slash. What this command does is it will copy the APK or installation file to the data local temp folder of your Fire Stick. So hit enter when you're done. You're not going to see anything happen other than the prompt will show you that it's ready for another line of code. So the next line you're going to be typing in is PM space install space minus I space com dot Amazon dot Venezia space forward slash data forward slash local forward slash TMP forward slash remapper for Disney plus APK. So what this does is it installs the remapper for Disney APK in the location that this version of Fire OS needs it to be installed in. So when you finish typing that, go ahead and click enter. When you're done, you should see it says success at the top. When you see that, you can put your keyboard down and pick up your Fire Stick remote again. Just click the home button. And like I said, what I'm going to do is I'm going to remap my Disney Plus button to open up Amazon Music. So now let's click that Disney Plus button. And this will pop up. You want to scroll down and find the app that you want to open when you hit the Disney Plus button. I mean, you can pick any app that's installed on your device. In this case, like I said, I'm going to pick the Amazon Music app. Click that. It's going to give you some info here. You don't really need to read this, but go ahead and click Exit. And now you're done. So next time you hit the Disney Plus button, it opens up Amazon Music. All right, so there you go. Remapping the buttons on the Amazon Fire Stick remotes. If you enjoyed today's video, please do click the like button below. And if you want to see more videos when they come out with Cord Cutters LI, please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.